Welcome to my passion project, The Wine Find Talks. This is where I share one wine that I love, why I love it, and then we taste it. So, let's talk. The wine I'm sharing with you today is the 2022 The Beach House Sauvignon Blanc from South Africa in the 1.5 liter format. This wine is like a beach house in a bottle, and it's perfect this time of year and right through till September actually. And the size, which is a magnum, works especially well on weekends when friends gather. In fact, this wine tastes like it was made for the long weekend, Victoria Day in Canada and Memorial Day in the United States, which is the unofficial kickoff to summer. This wine tastes all sunlit and pure and lip smacking and bright. More on that in a moment. And it's especially nice when you serve it with something that, you know, you'd serve at a beach house. So grilled prawns, um, creamy pasta salads, or fried fish. So let's taste. In the glass, beautiful sunlit color. It's sort of a, a sunlit straw, lovely. And on the nose, oh, I love that. It smells so tropical, citrusy. And there's that hint of gooseberry that you always get in Sauvignon Blanc. And on the palate, streams in like pure sunlight. It's lively, it's lifted, it's, it's, you know, it's got one of those palettes that's light and lively and not too high in alcohol. I think this only has, yes, 12.5% alcohol. It's dry, but not too dry. There's just a hint of residual sugar to round out the palate and it tastes sun-kissed and there's a little bit of length and on that length you get a little bit of minerality and salinity almost sea spray mm. now this is an inexpensive wine which is nice yet you wouldn't know because it tastes so pure and well balanced and well made. This is about 85% Sauvignon Blanc and it's got about 15% Semillon and Semillon creates a balance. It rounds out the, uh, the flavor, the profile and the structure because it's not as linear as Sauvignon Blanc. There's a hint of waxiness to that grape variety too which is felt texturally on the palate and that lends a little bit of gravitas it lends a little bit of character to a wine and yet it's inexpensive and i like that this is not just it doesn't taste cheap if you like so this is a great wine to know about it's a kind of wine that you can serve now and you can serve it right through to september or even in the winter time when you're craving a little bit of summeriness in a bottle and that is what i wanted to talk about 